Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. The screen time allows you to limit app usage in your iPad. This will come in handy when you have kids and you want to control the usage of their iPads. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set this up in settings. Let's get started. Go to settings in your iPad and scroll down and tap on screen time. First things first, I highly recommend starting by setting up a screen time passcode. Once you enter a new passcode, you will be prompted to creating a recovery. This is crucial in case if you forget the passcode so you have a way to recover it. And remember, this passcode is different from your usual lock screen passcode so you have a tendency to forget it. Provide the Apple ID and the password to proceed. Here scroll up and tap on app and website activity. Provide the passcode and turn this on. Once this is enabled, you will find three options, downtime, app limit, and always allowed apps. Let's start with downtime. You can enable for every day or customize the days and time as per your preference. During downtime, your child will not be able to use the apps. You can also turn this on if you require the iPad to be blocked at downtime. Just go back to screen time and now I will show you how to set up time limits for apps. Just tap on the option app limits, tap add limit. If you want to limit all apps and category, you can simply select this. Instead, if you want to set limit for category wise, for example, social app, you can tap on this and all the social apps will be added to the limit. You can also add limit to individual app. Instead of selecting all the games here, I will show you how to add time limit to a single game app. Tap on this arrow and select the app that you want to limit. Once it is selected, tap next. Here you can select the time to apply. If you select one hour, you will get only one hour to use social app and the game you selected. If you do not want to set the time limit for every day, you can customize the days as well. Let's say you want to allow two hours of screen time on Saturday, you can select that here. Now just tap here to go back and make sure to have this enabled so the apps will be blocked at the end of time limit. So that's all you have to do here, just tap add. Now you can see that the app time limits have been set for social apps and the snake game app. Let's try using the game app I blocked. I used it for almost one hour and now the time limit has reached. Your child can request for one more minute but after that a passcode is required for additional time. By providing the passcode you can approve for 15 minutes or one hour or all day. To remove an app limit, you can go back to the option app limit and simply swipe and delete it from here. Just tap delete and it's done. If you go back to screen time, you will find the third option always allowed apps. If you select any apps in here, these will be exempt from downtime or app limits. You can add or remove apps here. So those apps that you have added will work irrespective of whether the downtime or app limits are on. If you ever want to disable screen time, you can just turn off app and website activities. Just tap here and tap turn off apps and website activities. So thanks for tuning in. That's all for this video. If you have any questions, please drop a comment below. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I will catch you in the next video.